road. This is the first time I'm actually speaking on this vlog, but I'm here with my boyfriend <laughs> and we are in Rhodes. Neither of us have been to Greece before and we've just come for an eight day holiday. Mm. We're staying in a five star hotel, adults only, all inclusive. And obviously, you know, if you've seen my videos before, I am a flight attendant, so I rarely see this one at the moment. So this holiday is very needed and we're very excited. But you would have just seen, we just landed, we've just got to our hotel room. Let me give you a quick little tour that you walk in there and then you've got a lovely big mirror and then you've got this nice bathroom it's just really modern and clean and fresh the hotel we're staying in by the way is the ixion grand suites so it was a quite an expensive hotel obviously peak june which is like the summer season in europe very expensive the room we got was one of the cheap options but it's still all inclusive but yeah just a nice basic modern room we have got a lovely balcony so far, it looks really nice. Jack is just lounging around. As if we've had a very long travel day. Yeah. But yeah, that was just a quick room tour. So obviously this is going to be a vlog of our road holiday. If you are new here, I am a flight attendant and most of the time I vlog my travels with work. All my holidays, I like to look back on it. And if you like enjoying watching it too, then that's just a bonus. But yeah, it's nine o'clock and dinner finishes at 9.30. So we're gonna go and try and get some dinner, aren't we? Yes. Get off the bed then, let's go. We're in that app, really. <laughs> <laughs> That's all half dinner. That is pretty much it for our first day. We had a little venture. We've sat and unwind in the room, caught up on our phones. Um, that's about it, really. And yeah, just taking my skin makeup off because I've already had on today. Doing some skincare and then going, to, oh no, and then going to bed. See you in the morning. Just got to the beach near our hotel. Well, literally outside our hotel. Gorgeous, isn't it? Colour of the water. Can't even open my eyes. We're here for a few hours for lunch, so we thought we'll just start on the beach, tan really nicely, maybe go in the ocean. That's like the same colour as the Maldives, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. We went to the Maldives, it's actually that colour. Gorgeous. We've just been in the sea for about an hour. <laughs> we didn't bring anything with us, so we were playing catch and then we were off. So it's all sandy and wet. Um, yeah, just ordered a round of drinks. Um, pet food, a mango cocktail and a passion fruit cocktail. Give us a taste of this drink. I don't know, we're doing it. Yeah, just taking it out. It's nice. <laughs> That's sour. Is it? Oh. oh. That's well strong. Try the other one, pass it here. This is my mango version. Oh, that's really strong. Ooh. We've just come back to the room. I went to the toilet and just like freshened ourselves up because we're going for lunch now. Um, and I said, Jack, have you noticed anything about my bikini bottoms? because I just cottoned on and he was like, well, earlier I saw your label hanging out and I just thought it was hanging out. I was like, my bottoms are inside out. I can't show you obviously because this is going online, but my bikini bottoms have been inside out for like four or five hours. I've been to the beach, I've been to the pool and I've got on inside out bikini bottoms. <laughs> this stuff only happens to me. But anyway, we're gonna go to lunch and then Maybe go back out in the sun. Just come to Greek and a cart first shop. We've got that feta, honey, sesame, yeah. Chips are banging. Oh, they look so good. Give me a taste test quickly. Oh, the steak or the chips? The steak, not the chips. Chips are chips. I've got a steak now, though. Quickly. 
to the beach to try and catch sunset at the beach that's on our hotel. We'll see if we catch it or not. So, so much. Okay, you ready, Jack? Let's go. Got Oreo chocolate cake. Creme brulee, cherry jelly, which was a big kick yesterday, <laughs> cherry cake, and a chocolate Oreo tart, apparently. Would you like to do the honors of trying something? Okay. Start with the Oreo cake. Yeah. Mm. Let's go. is day three in Rhodes, obviously our second full day. We have decided to venture out into Rhodes Old Town today. Um, it's a Saturday morning and we thought maybe there'd be some cute markets on or something. So we're going to go into Rhodes Old Town today, um, only for the morning for a few hours and then come back and sit in the pool and catch the last bit of the sun. It gets really hot in the afternoon anyway, so we're not going to miss out on much. But we're going to go grab some breakfast and then we're going to go to Rhodes Town. Old Town, so I've got on this like green dress pink bikini, some jewellery, and then I put a little matching flower on my bag. So yeah, let's go. So this is Old Town. We've just, we ended up getting a taxi um, for 15 euros from Ixia, which isn't bad really. And yeah, we've been dropped off here. It's very hot today, isn't it? Like is, yeah. yesterday, I kept saying to Jack, it's not windy, hot, it's not that hot because obviously I do a lot of Middle East and stuff with my work. So I was like, it's not hot, it's not hot, but it was so windy. And now actually because the wind has dropped quite significantly, it's so warm and it's only half nine. So we'll see as the day goes on, but yeah. This is weird how it's a road. Cars keep coming through here. We cannot figure out what those little balls are. So let us know. Jack wants to know. Okay. Just saying. Someone let us know what those balls are. I said they were cannon bullets. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what they are. Cool. Very, very cute. Hello. There's a guy doing a really cool instrument over there. Jack's a little bewildered. <laughs> it's just a big like metal thing. Very beautiful music. Should go that way. That's cool. We just spoke to an amazing guy. Can you hear that instrument in the background? I don't think you can. Um, but it's an Australian guy traveling the world and we just got to speak to him for a while. Asking about his instrument, it's called Hand Pan. They were made in Switzerland and he got a mini one gifted for his travels. And he travels the world and he gave us loads of tips of things to do in rows. And it's just nice. One of my favorite things about exploring and traveling is meeting new people. And it's really cool, isn't it? Yeah. So just walking down these back roads, I'm it's absolutely boiling going rosy as you can see. If we hadn't have just eaten breakfast we probably would have come here. Look how gorgeous this is. In the midst of the castle. Very nice. Very nice. Gorgeous. <laughs> this is proper Greek isn't it? Yeah. We're on a boat right now and they sell everything ocean and I'm loving it. Just found another seashell boat. Look how gorgeous it is. Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, it is lovely. Found this little square. And my, it's hot, but it's beautiful. So cool. They've got loads. Poseidon. 
Back at the pool. Cheers. Beautiful. Banana jelly, chocolate panna cotta, trifle, hemp caramel. Try, please try the banana jelly. No, I, I just banana. tried it, it's really nice. It's not, it's not like it doesn't even taste like that. Yeah. Just went to the snack bar, got some Fanta, hot dogs, chocolate pie. <laughs> I ended up getting my hair wet when I said I wouldn't. But we were wrestling each other in the kitchen. <laughs> We've moved to a quiet pool and it's so relaxing. All the sound of the crickets. Just come back to the room and we've given us a little cheesecake, a little fruit platter. Bless them, that's so cute. So I've quickly gotten changed. I decided to go makeup free and my hair's still wet and knotty from the pool but I can't really be bothered to fancy get like dressed up all fancy tonight. We're literally just gonna get some dinner and play Uno on the beach listening to the entertainment here. So yeah, super chill. I'm not planning on doing much. So super chill. I'm actually waiting for Jack to get ready. Um, um and then we're gonna yeah, go get dinner, sit on the beach. Jack's in the shower at the moment. But yeah. That's my fit. As soon as Jack's ready, we'll go get some dinner. And then I would actually like to come back and pack after dinner and entertainment because we've been here. This will be our third night tonight. And look at this. Can't live with this mess anymore. Like it's everywhere. So yeah, I do look very rosy. Maybe I'll put on a bit of something. No, I can't be bothered. I can't be bothered. So yeah. We're at dinner and Jack picked up a bit of shark. Are you gonna try it now? Go. Okay. Oh, straight in for it. It's all right. Is it? Let me try it. it tastes like fish. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, put that there. Thank you. Jack got me jelly and ice cream. It's so good. Getting ready, they're doing a musical theatre show. <laughs> We've booked a spa appointment for later. We've both got a massage, facial, and some other bits and bobs in the spa. Um, they just say we can use the facilities always, but obviously it's really nice and sunny if you want to make the most of being out in the sun. Um, and I can feel the sun over there and it's so hot already. But yeah, so we're gonna chill by the pool, go to the spa this afternoon. And then tonight the hotel put on like a modern violin performance. And I've actually wanted to see one of those ever since I watched the first season of Bridgerton a few years ago. So I'm really looking forward to that. Hopefully that's quite good. Um, we also just went to reception and booked some quad bikes for tomorrow. So it's all happening now. But yeah, we're just going to enjoy sitting in the pool, going in the sun. And yeah, that's about it really. We're at the quiet pool today. That's why it looks totally different. But I just prefer the beds here and it's obviously really nice and quiet. Just got ourselves a little snack from the snack bar. We have spent pretty much the whole day in the pool. Um, and I'm getting a bit rosy now, so we just want to get a little pit stop snack break. But we're really, really relaxing on this holiday. It's lovely. Mm. Salute. Just walked into the spa. Look at that. Just filled out medical forms. We're going into the spa now. Oh, it looks gorgeous. Wow. I'd love to dump, jump in that pool, but I said I'd love to jump in that pool, but we're about to have a treatment, so we won't. So we just got out of the spa. Oh, that was lovely, wasn't it? I had such a nice, like, full body massage, and then a facial, which my skin doesn't really look any different, but oh, it was just so relaxing. We're now heading out to the main pool area because. 
I want to get a drink and maybe some ice cream or something and then go sit on the balcony in our room for about an hour and get ready for the evening. It's such a chill out today. I feel rejuvenated. Beautiful. Look at this. The weather is perfect. So we've just raced to the pool area because I can't remember if I said or not, but at 8 p.m. tonight, the hotel is putting on a modern violin performance. Basically, I'm thinking it's gonna be like reggaeton music, you know, like modern songs turned quartet, that kind of vibe. If it is, then I'm so excited and I'm gonna love every minute. And if it's not, I'll probably love every minute anyway. I love musical instruments. <laughs> I don't play any, but I love them. So yeah, Jack has got the England versus yeah. Slovakia. Slovakia. Give us a Slovakia game on, and we just sat here. What I was gonna say is, we secured this view. We don't actually want the front view because those seats aren't that comfortable. We've got a sofa, yeah, literally that bit in the pool there is the stage, and the sunset will be that way. So we've got a really, really good spot here. My phone is. But yeah, but we've got 50 minutes to kill. I've got this like. That's it, it's something very comfy. I've done no makeup, makeup, and we're just gonna chill and wait for the violin performance. I'm so excited. But yeah, we've got such a good spot, like literally directly in front of the stage. And we're just gonna chill, watch the football game, maybe go get a drink and just chill here. Lovely Sunday evening. I can't remember if I said, but the massage was amazing as well, so we're feeling really relaxed. Loving it. Monday, quite a few days have passed since we got to Rhodes. Yesterday we went to get a massage and we had the most amazing just spa experience I probably had. And then last night we watched the violin show next to the pool and it was amazing. Like I can't express how much I love like pianos, violins, like everything kind of quartet. Um yeah, I love that, especially when it's modern music turned acoustic and quartet and I can't think of the right word it's gone my mind's gone blank I'm so tired but yeah I just love all of that and it was a really lovely evening we went to bed woken up and we've rented a quad bike today today I'm kind of living my Mamma Mia-esque era so yeah I just need to take my pick up flower I'm going but I've got my bag my little Just so you know, you landed there. You were so close to going down there. It's fine, I could have got you, but still. Um, and I've got my pink and aqua Giselles on. But yeah, let's go get some breakfast and then head out on a quad bike. So we just 
just got to the Valley of Butterflies, got here safely. The fuel light did actually just come on the quad, so we're a bit confused because <laughs> we thought we had a full fuel tank. Uh, so hopefully when we get back on the road, we'll get to a petrol station, yeah, fingers crossed. But obviously by the time it's posted, we'll find out. Uh, but yeah, we're at the Butterfly Valley. Yeah. Um, my brother and his girlfriend came here last year and said it was amazing, so thought we'd pay a visit. Apparently it's in season, so we should see lots of butterflies. So let's have a look. You can't see on camera, but there's so many already. Like even just on there, they're all sleeping. There's so many just flocking around, and it's only just until it's gorgeous. You have to be really quiet and not disturb any of them. Look at them all sleeping. Oh. I don't know if you can see, but there's loads fluttering around there. Oh wow. Look how many there are. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Look at all of them on the tree. Literally every leaf and that tree has one. Wow. They're everywhere. All on that tree, that's all butterflies. All on the rocks, that's butterflies. There is so many everywhere. This is the slump. They're on every single leaf, every single tree. So we just made it to the entrance, which we thought we were already in. <laughs> We've gone from here to here. We need to go up there. But we can then come all the way back down. But yeah, it's gorgeous. And luckily, we came just in season. Like, so obviously, this is what you see usually. We've come just in season. Although it would be cool just to walk through and see loads yeah, and loads yeah. of, um, what are they called, cocoons. Yeah, cocoons. Ready? Let's go. Let's go. Look at all of them, wow. They're everywhere. <laughs> I've literally gone red. But we're here. Hello, so we've parked and the guy, it was like a guy waved us over and let us park there and we paid him. So it should be seven euros, but because obviously we've got a quad, it was five euros. Yeah, we didn't park in the um, space, did we? Yeah. It wasn't like a proper space, it was like, I'll just put it in here. Um, and he was, and he's like in a smart uniform, so I'm just trusting him that it's a safe space. <laughs> but yeah, look at all these gorgeous little restaurants. I'm glad we came here to yeah. Lindor. It's proper Greek. So let's explore. There's the Aquapolis up there, or however you pronounce it. We're just on a rooftop for a drink. I am absolutely baking. Absolutely. Yeah. Just stop. Jack's got pink lemonade. How is it? Oh, that's that so good. good. Oh. Okay, I've got bits of it, so I can't put I got apple sure? and pan pomegranate. I look so red in the camera. Oh my god, it's basically apple juice. Mm. That's beautiful, that is. Well, there is bits in it, and I don't like bits. Let's try something else. Oh, 
Oh, yours is the eight. Ready? We actually got just sauce because Jack's a big baby, he doesn't like veg. No, <laughs> you don't like veg. Don't and you, both of us. Take a bite then. Has it got chips in it? I thought they're supposed to have chips in it. No, some of them do. No, but there is chips. Mm. Is it nice or not? Mm. Yeah? <laughs> it's my turn now. There is chips in here. Oh, nice. Throw it everywhere. Mm. It's good though. Mmm, Made me want to put my whole body in the water today. Let's go. Little waterfall, beautiful. I am absolutely bacon. Oh, no, I so say we nice. go back to the hotel and have a swim. Yeah. And drive past some nice beaches on the way back. <laughs> you think? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, nice day. A nice day. I'm boiling. Same. I'm breaking. Beautiful. <laughs> I went to Falaraki, went past my brother's hotel when he stayed here um, and now we're in this like cute little beach bar called Wave having an orange calippo. Love orange flavoured ice lollies or like twisters, soleros, all the fruity ice lollies. <laughs> vlog today we've had a day literally just sat at the pool and in the beach and just chilling in the hotel basically off our phones i finally finished my book i just finished icebreaker it's such a good book i loved it um yeah so just chucked on some outfits 
I've got on some like, hang on, let me show you. Excuse the mess of the room, but I've just chucked on this. Jack's got that on. Yeah. But yeah, so obviously we're gonna go get some dinner. There's a DJ on in the hotel tonight. So we'll watch the DJ and then go to bed and we've got another exciting day tomorrow. Lovely. Thanks. Good to you. <laughs> morning i'm looking a little bit different today i've actually put a full face of makeup on for the first time on this trip um so yeah looking a little bit different to myself to be honest with you um today i've got on a cute little white and blue pop of greek dress because we're off to simi we're going to simi island we've booked a ferry at nine so we need to get to rose town and get on the ferry for 8 30 and then it's well it's not a ferry it's like a speedboat thing um and it's taking us to simi we have about four three well three and a half four hours on the island and then we get the speedboat back and that costs us 20 pounds per person so i think that's pretty good but we're off to simi and i thought we might as well dress up for the occasion because i've not worn any nice outfits like this whole trip like outfits that i packed as in going out dresses so yeah jack's got a little blue and white outfit on he's just in the bathroom getting ready because i've been holding it for ages sorry i feel like i've got a hair oh there we go i had a hair on my lip but yeah i'm also really not hungry this morning so we've decided to skip breakfast and then just eat when we get to simi um we have luckily got some like bubby to snacks and hula hoops that we brought with us anyways so we're going to take those for the ferry i keep saying the ferry it's not a ferry but you know what i mean so yeah let's go <laughs> Shops like that one over there. Jack went quiet. No, and I mean, I know he's up to something, and he went molly. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> it's so gorgeous here. Anyone has watched Luca, the Disney film? This is literally what it reminds me of. It's just stunning, like it's a movie set, it's beautiful. Just got an ice cream. I got biscoff and marshmallow. Jack's there. So what did you go for in the end? What did you go for in the end? One strawberry strawberry. Yeah. Just literally strolling around the island, looking at all the views and like the little shops like this, and it is just absolutely stunning. Simi sea salt. It's just stunning, isn't it? Beautiful. Stunning. So hot, isn't it? We're literally Definitely. just walking around and it is boiling. We're looking for a place to well we're not that hungry, but we feel like we, we feel like we should eat. So we'll see. We stopped for some snacks, plain Uno, gorgeous view. This is just peaceful, isn't it? Uh, this is my idea of a nice day out. <laughs> So the place that we stopped for snacks, 
<laughs> it's amazing. No, the place was fine. It was just it felt very rushed, and the food. I can't even talk about it. It had a bit of a weird twang, and our stomachs fell a bit. I don't know what it was. I don't think the food was awful, undercooked or anything. I just think it was a taste. It's made us feel a bit. And the fact that it's hot and we're bloated, like we've been really struggling to eat the past few days. Just out of pure, like, we've eaten too much the first few days. The heat, um, no you know, no veg, like no healthy food. My stomach feels a bit weak. Sorry, our drinks came, so I got interrupted. But um, yeah, so we just wanted to head back to the boat. We've got about an hour and 20 minutes until our boat leaves, and we just want to go. Like, it's so gorgeous here, but we're so bloated. Like, it hurts to walk around because it's so hot. Um, anyway, we've just stopped at this cute little cafe. We've got two Fantas, two waters, just to keep hydrated. The heat is unbearable. This is the view. Stunning, gorgeous views. We're on the boat. We're in the downstairs bit because it's air conditioned, and we are heading home. Back towards Rhodes, Rhodes, <laughs> Rhodes Old Town. Let's go. Just back at the pool. I'm about to start this book. This is the current view and situation. Gorgeous. Absolute bliss. Please ignore the state of the room. It's an absolute mess. But it's the last night and usually I'd be like, oh, the last night, you know, let's make an effort. But I'm not going to lie. I've had my makeup on all day. I'm tired and I'm hungry and I just want to go get some food, sit and play Uno and watch tonight's entertainment, which is some like a jazz band thing and come back and just clean the room and watch Bridgerton. So I've just gone for pretty much the same outfit as the very first night, plain black, no jewelry really, just very plain and comfortable so I can go and eat it, all the food because it is Italian night, which is my favorite. So hopefully eat loads of meatballs if they've got any. Jack looks absolutely gorgeous in his nice outfit and I've got this morning's makeup on. <laughs> but anyway, last night, how'd you feel? Oh, sad to go. Sad to go. It's been amazing though. Yeah, it been. It's been so good. Yeah. And Simi today, as you saw, was absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous. wasn't it? Gorgeous. Gorgeous. But yeah, yeah. let's go get some dinner. Ooh. See you later. Let's go. <laughs> Goodbye, room. We're all packed up and ready to go. Well, so we're checking out now. It's 11 a.m. We don't actually get picked up from the hotel until 6 p.m. to go get our flight home. Um, and the hotel have actually said that we can use the pool, we can still have access to all-inclusive food and drinks. So we've basically got an extra day until 6 p.m. So we're gonna go check out and give our stuff to the reception desk and then just enjoy another day at the pool. 